Good morning everyone. How are you all? I hope you all are fine. So today we are going to study EVS. What we have done in the previous video? We have done the introduction of my home. In that introduction, I have told you how a home protect us from many things. The many things are rain, hot sun, robbers and wild animals. And we have studied the part of the room like ceiling, floor, walls, windows and doors. Then we have studied the types of room. The types of room we have in our house. They are bedroom, bathroom, kitchen, study room and dining room and drawing room. Okay. Then what we have studied after that? We have studied that about types of house and we have in that portion we have studied about the different types of houses. Now we are going to read the chapter from our book. Today we are going to do the reading of the chapter My Home. So let's go. Need of a house. Need of a house. Page number 30. First is need of a house. Every living being needs a shelter. All the living things need a shelter. Shelter under which we live. Your house is your shelter from rain, hot sun, robbers and animals. Our house give us shelter from rain, sun, wild animals and robbers. Okay, now we have parts of house. Now we will study the parts of house. A house has a different parts. A house has a different parts. You can see a lizard or a spider on a wall. You must have seen a spider or lizard on the wall of your houses. I hope because I have seen in mine the fan hangs down from the ceiling. The fan hangs from the ceiling. Everyone In everyone's house, the fan hangs from the ceiling. The door and the window let the fresh air. If our, how, why do we have a doors and a windows in our house? Because it let the fresh air to come in our house. Okay? You clean the floor with the broom. Then we have floor which is cleaned by the broom and the mop okay so you can see in the picture we have ceiling we have floor we have walls windows and doors now come to page number 31 come to page number 31 here we will study about the rooms in the house rooms in the house a house has many different room a house has many different room there are many different room in the house like i rest and sleep where do i rest and sleep in the bedroom in the bedroom then my parents cook my parents cook food in the this is a kitchen my parents cook food in the kitchen now what do we see we see that a boy standing in front of a table and a chair this table and chair is known as where we eat the food is dining room i eat my food okay this is a dining table where we sit and eat our food in the dining room we sit and eat our food in the dining room now we have this, this is a drawing room where the sofas and the tables are kept and the guests sit in the room. I talk to guests, I talk to guests. This is a drawing room where the sofa, table, carpets are kept. This is a drawing room. Then let's see what is next. I brush my teeth and bath. This is the place where we brush our teeth and bath. In the bathroom, yes, I brush and I, sorry, I brush my teeth and bath in the bathroom. This is a bathroom. Then we have, this is a study room. This is a study room where we study. I study in the 
in the study room so we have studied about six rooms in our houses sorry in our house bedroom kitchen dining room drawing room bathroom and study room now turn the page and come to page number 32 now come to page number 32 now we will study the types of the house the types of the house the types of a house we live in different type of houses we live in different types of houses i have told you previously also that there are many types of house we use different materials to make our houses and not all the houses are made up of cements and iron so many the different types of houses are made up of different different materials okay now the first is the this is a tent a tent is made up of canvas cloth a tent is a made up of canvas cloth now what is this this is a igloo an igloo is made up of ice blocks so how how we make a igloo we make a igloo with the ice ice blocks with the help of a ice blocks then we have then we have a house board this is a house board a house board is made up of wood a house board is made up of wood we live in the house board it uh, the house board stays in the water okay we live in the water okay this is a boat house then we have cottage this is a cottage a cottage is made up of wood this house is made from the woods okay then we have a bungalow this is a bungalow a bungalow is made up of bricks iron and cement the bungalow are the big houses bungalows are the big houses they are made up of brick iron and cement then we have hut then we have hut a hut is made up of mud and thatches a hut is made up of mud and thatches okay then we have carven then we have carven a carven is a moving house made up of metal it look like a car and it has a wheel and and it is made up of metal okay it is a house on the wheel then we have a flat is a small house in the tall buildings there are in the big cities you can see a tall tall buildings and it has a small small flats these are called the flats where we live so children this is this is it in the chapter okay we have studied about the my home and the rooms we have in our home and then the types of the houses the type the different types of houses i hope you all have understood the chapter and you will do the reading on your own okay you will once again read the chapter on your own and you will you will ask your problems in the next next virtual class in next online class you can ask me the problem do you have in reading this chapter okay till then bye everyone have a nice day